Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, um, as you guys can tell by the title, it is RuPaul's DragCon 2018. And I left a poll up on my Instagram last night, which was on May 11th. And I left a little poll saying, should I vlog my VidCon? Not VidCon, I'm, I'm stuck with VidCon. It's not VidCon, it's DragCon. If I should vlog my DragCon experience since it is my first year going. And a lot of you guys said yes, so that's what we're going to do today. Um... Yeah, I'm gonna glam my face and I'll see you guys after. Okay, so my makeup is almost done, but my right is gonna leave me, so I'll see you guys when I'm at the convention or whatever. Okay guys, so I kind of finished my makeup. I'm gonna do my lips when I'm getting there, but I just want you guys to see how ugly it is right now. So you can like barely even see outside the freeway. You can't even see towards that way at all. Those are like, there's supposed to be a lot of mountains right there, but yeah, I'm on my way now, um, and I'll see you guys when I'm there. Okay guys, so I was gonna follow Nikki's tutorial, and I was gonna put like a little lash right there, but it just wasn't working, and the lash dried, the lash glue dried, and it looks like kind of funky now, so if you guys were wondering, that's what that is, do not come for me. Also, my nose is a little patchy, so... Okay guys, so I'm at the metro stop right now. I miss my friend, that bitch left, so I'm gonna catch the other one and meet him in like the next two stops so girl it's been like a hassle but i'll see you guys when i'm at dragcon hopefully so fucking mad. i'm at the metro station not the same one at another one okay guys so i'm at the right station right now and the right bitch is with me finally finally finally, finally. what the hell but yeah guys we're right here we're ready for dragcon bitch catches there vidcon here we come I, you know in the first metro uh huh. I already saw people were going and shit. Like I know there was some girl wearing like some horn, some rainbow really? horn. So but like, like I didn't like the first train because it was like full of like get away people. So like I got. That. Yeah, talk about the. Remember I told you that some girl was trying to make me a Christian. Okay. That's why I met the fucking. That's why I missed the train actually. But yeah, guys, we'll get to you guys when we're like off the metro, whatever. We should be there soon. So. Like, So we're on the metro now, on our way there. We're like 20 minutes away. Watch it never upload No, I probably won't, but I probably will, so. Yes, girl, makes me look. Okay, guys, so we're here at the Los Angeles Convention Center. Emmanuel. Manuel. 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 I don't think that. Bitch, I'll fuck you up. <laughs> and I'm just right here, guys. Can you get a shot of me? Smoking this cute little blunt. Okay, that's good. Wait, let's get the hot dog. <laughs> Living for the wig. Here. We made it. We bought our bracelets. Show you. Wait, hold on. I want to take a picture like that too. It's I'm okay, a coffee and it. And yeah, I'm like kind of really excited to go in there. Stop. Take a picture with me in it. Okay. I'm saying. <laughs> Bitch, I'm living. Look, your Snapchat. What's your Snapchat? He's manual. Yeah. Holds manual. So yeah guys, um, I'll show you guys more once we're inside and we're gonna do a little shopping or whatever. Manual. 
Okay guys, so the day has came to an end. It is now 8.11 p.m. And I honestly have to say today's was such a good day. I like had so much fun. We, I honestly didn't like meet everyone who I wanted to meet, but I met the people who I really, really wanted to meet. I don't know if that made sense, but yeah, like I really met the people who I came here to meet, which was Jeffree Star, and that's it. Jeffree Star and Jeffree Star only. But I also met Rich Lux. I met <clears throat> who else did I meet? Girl, I forgot already. It's just been an hour, like an hour or two ago. So I met Cynthia Lee Fontaine. I met Rich Lux. Like I said, I met <laughs> Stacy or something like that. Stacy, I don't even know her name, girl, to be honest. It was just honestly so full of people, like, people that I loved. I met Sandra Deluxe, who I love. I met Hank. Because it was honestly just so good. And I'm so sorry that I didn't record, like, everything. I really, really wanted to record a lot. But once you're there, like, you're in the moment and you really don't have time to do, like, to really record what you want to record. So, I hope the footage that I put in there is, like, good enough. Hopefully. I'm not really sure, but... Yeah, guys, RuPaul's Dragon 2018 was such a success. I'll see you guys there again next year. Okay, hey guys, so I'm back from RuPaul's Dragon. Um, honestly, today has been such a good day. I literally cannot even. I'm gonna get a little bit of loose powder and powder my face because she's looking a little oily, you know? She's looking a little dewy, even though that's not the look we were going for. I really don't mind. Let me just get like a small little brush. I'm just gonna powder away. Oh well, I was very oily. Okay, guys, that's much, much better. I was, like, super oily, like, girl, who even are you? And my white, I kind of don't like this white eyeliner that I'm wearing today. It's by NYX because it kind of, like, flakes off. But, you know, it was cute for the moment, guys. But anyways, guys, I'm back home. What it do, what it is, and what's up? Got your homie in the cut. Um, guys, today has been such a good day, like I said. Um, it was so fun. I met so many queens, guys. Let me get my phone. Actually, no, I'll, like, try to insert some pictures and videos on here so you guys can see the royalty behind the scenes, what was going on. And, guys, it was honestly so much fun. I did a little bit of shopping with my friend Manuel, as you guys can see from the vlog. Um, I didn't really vlog much, first of all, because... I kind of felt like I wasn't in the moment. I was just, like, on my phone trying to, like, record things. So, at a point, I was just like, you know what? F this. I'm just going to enjoy it. And I'm just going to, like, you know, go on with my day and do a little meeting, greeting with the queens. And I was so blown away with everyone. It's so beautiful, honestly. I love all the queens. They're so, so nice. Guys, but anyways, let me just go ahead and show you guys some things that I purchased or that I got. The first thing, oh no, I will leave this one for last because it's like my favorite, honestly. So, the first thing that mainly is everything from Jeffree Star, the queen. And I'm going to do like a little unboxing for you guys. So, this is what I had got from him. And I'm sure you guys can already tell what it is by the box. It just looks like this. That was not even planned, guys, I swear. 
So I got, yes, I got the pink mirror, guys. So welcome back to my channel. Honestly, guys, this mirror is so, so cute. Like, I don't want to expose my room because it's so dirty. But this mirror, this mirror is everything. Not just because it's, like, star-shaped and pretty and pink, but... I don't know, it's just honestly so cute. It's giving me all my life. Like, everything I need to survive. So, yeah. This was my first purchase. One of my first purchase. The Jeffree Star Pink um, Mirror. Pen Mirror. Oh, my God. Let me just talk a little bit about the Jeffree Star situation. So, a couple of months ago, I don't know if you guys remember on my snap, I had went to the Morphe store, the grand opening Morphe store in Rancho Cucamonga. And I literally waited in line for Jeffrey like for like six hours and I didn't even get to see him because everyone was cutting and cutting and cutting. So whatever, I didn't even get to see him. So I was so bummed. I waited in line so like for so long for nothing. And then I got some like little like, I don't know. These are like some press on nails or like some strips that you put on your nails and they like adhere. I don't even know, bro. I was like, it's a cute little moment. Um, but yeah, I sit in line for so long, guys. I didn't even get to see him. I was so mad. And this time I waited a long time, too. I waited three hours. Not as long as last time I waited three hours, but it was so worth it, guys, because I actually did get to meet him, and it was a guarantee. So I wasn't even worried about, like, waiting for that long. And I also got this picture, guys, from Cynthia Lee Fontaine. Cuckoo. I met her. She's such a nice person, guys. She said she loved my makeup. She really, really loved it. So that was a cute little treat, guys. She's such a nice person, like I said. So that was like a nice little treat. Um, the second thing that I bought, guys, uh, was the Jeffree Star Family Collection, guys. So cute. And let me tell you guys about this one. I paid $25 for this, guys. $25 for all six of these shades. You guys can see that, right? Let me just go ahead and try on a little one because I like I wore gloss all day but I like obviously the gloss is gone so I'm gonna go ahead and try I'm gonna put daddy on my lips or not daddy I'm gonna put Nathan actually or actually I'm going to put actually Baby Daddy. I wasn't going to put Nathan, but I'm just going to put Baby Daddy. Guys, and this is actually also my first time trying a Jeffree Star liquid lipstick. I have never tried any of his liquid lipsticks. So let's see how that goes. And I'm just go ahead and get the mirror really quick. I don't know why I put it away. I really don't want it to get scratched or anything. Oh, guys, so let me go ahead and keep on telling you guys what happened. So I was waiting in line for him. And like I said, for three hours, and I went, like, I was already next to take a picture, so I went up to him, we took a boomerang or whatever, and I, as I was leaving out the booth, like, for the next person to come in, I accidentally exit out the boomerang, so, like, I deleted it. I don't really get any smell. So, guys, I accidentally deleted the, the, um... The boomerang, so the guy said that it was all, like that it was fine, so he let me um take another one with Jeffrey. I love how smooth it glides on, honestly. So I'm gonna go in for a second dip. I thought these were gonna have like such a good smell since everyone always talks about like the smell. So yeah, guys, I got to meet Jeffrey and everything was better. Like honestly, my whole day was complete. The only I only went to RuPaul's Drag Con for Jeffrey and for RuPaul. Honestly, like I obviously went for the queens too, but those were the two persons that I really, really wanted to meet. 
And I met Jeffrey, but not RuPaul. The line was ridiculously long, honestly. And plus, by the time I had finished seeing Jeffrey, I don't think I would have made it to RuPaul because they were about to close already. Okay, guys, so that is Baby Daddy on the lips. Super cute, super smooth. It doesn't feel like hard or anything. It doesn't feel dry or tacky. Which I love. I hate when like liquid lipsticks feel tacky. So guys, really quick, I'm going to go ahead and take this one off. And I want to try this one right here. Delicious. Oh, no, it's not delicious. It's actually diamond. Which is this blue one. It's probably going to look really, really crazy. But who cares? We're going to try it anyway. So I'm gonna go ahead and get my makeup wipes and I'm gonna set the mirror down. I really don't want it to get scratched. That color is definitely cute, it's a moment, but I don't really feel like it suits my skin tone like the best. Okay guys, so I'm going to go ahead and take Diamond and I'm going to try that one and see how that goes. Okay, now this is more like it, honestly. I love the way this looks with my skin tone. Like, I really, really do. Okay, guys, so this is Diamond on the Lips, and this is definitely... Um, it's a look. Honestly, I really, really like this color. Like I said, I really like how it complements my skin tone. It's probably not the best for my skin tone, but I honestly feel like I could definitely rock this. It's cute. It feels right. I don't know what's up with, like, the focusing on my phone. It's, like, a little off, guys. What? It was almost scary. I thought I heard somebody. Okay, guys, so that's what I got. That's the second thing I got, the family collection. Super cute. And, <clears throat> guys, I really, it sucks that I didn't get to meet, I, oh, I actually did meet Jeffrey. I just didn't get him to sign any of my products because apparently we were told that he was not going to sign anything. So, all we had to do was get our phone prepared. So guys, the last product I bought from Jeffree Star that I had to buy, like I literally had to buy this one, I could not not buy it, was the Blood Sugar Palette, guys. I'm honestly so freaking excited to use this. I cannot, I almost don't even want to use it. That's how I like excited I am about it. So I love everything about this like palette. I love the feel to it. I love like, 
I even love this box. It's like just a regular old standard box, but so the way this is, and I love how it's like all his handles are like in the back. It's so like nice and clean. I just really really like it. So it says blood sugar in the front, and then like it has these two little things that you have to like open. It's like super rustic. It like gives me old vibes. And it just opens up like this. And this is what the palette looks like, guys. I don't know how well you guys can see that. But I'm sure you guys all know what this palette looks like by now. Do not look at the mirror. Because like I said, my room is super hecka dirty. So that's the palette, guys. And I honestly cannot wait to use this palette. One of these looks used. But I don't know if it's the way the pen is pressed. It's called extraction. It's like it looks like super dry and like if it's almost been swatched. Uh, excuse me. Guys, this lip, honestly, I'm really living for it. But yeah, guys, this was a... Oh, I even love the smell to it, guys. So I'll for sure be doing a look with these soon, guys. You guys better watch out on that one. So this is the last Jeffree Star product that I purchased. I was really trying to splurge on his like on his little products because I've never really tried his products before. I tried his highlighters because my friends have them and stuff, but I don't think I've ever tried his liquid lipsticks or his eyeshadow palettes. I think I've tried his lip scrubs at the Morphe store. I'm not sure. Guys, this lip is honestly, I live for it. I really, really like him. I'm over here sitting, popping these little things. Who else does this? Am I the only one who does this? I know I cannot be the only one who does this. I'll leave it in the comments below. Okay, so that's the last Jeffree Star product that I bought. Look at this paper, guys. Even the paper is cute. I'm gonna say that as gift wrap paper. Welcome back to my channel. So guys, that's that. And then another purchase that I did was this little fan. Just a cute little fan. Oh, I fucked up. So guys, the last thing that I bought was this cute little fan. I got it on backwards. There you go. There you go, mama. Tense, tense, tense across the board. Across the board. So this fan was like $20 or $25, I believe. I'm not sure. 20 yeah, I think it was 20 The other ones were 15 This one was 20 because it's from Hey Queen. Hey Queen. And this was really coming in handy up in that bitch because bitches were sweaty, musty, crusty, dusty up in that motherfucker. I was like, girl, some of y'all queens need deodorant and need some motherfucking showers in y'all life. Like, oh my God. It's just, it's not cute. People are all sweaty. They're all hot and bothered. But next year, I do want to go and drag myself. You know, I do want to be one of the people walking in drag and, like, you know, catching all the spotlight and, like, you know, whatnot. And I want to be a rude girl really quick. So, we're going to make this happen, guys. So, yeah, guys, this was another product that I bought. Um, last but not least, which is my favorite product. That's why I saved it for the very, very last. Is... This cute as freaking adorable shirt that I cannot, that I cannot live. Like, I cannot. So you guys are ready for this cuteness? Guys, I cannot. I live for this. It's basically all of the queens in mermaid form. Super, super fucking cute. I live for this. When I saw this, I automatically knew this was for me. This was, like, literally meant for me. So, we have... Just to name some of the queens, we have... 
Uh, Bianca Del Rio, we have Alyssa, we have Miss Fame, we have Katya, there's Alaska, there's um, Violet, there's Naomi, there's Kim Chi, there's Latrice. There's, I think it's all of the girls, if I'm not mistaken. No, actually, it's not all of the girls. There's Sasha. It's not all of the girls, but it's most of the girls. So, guys, really quick, I'm going to go throw this on, and I'll come right back. So, guys, I am back with the shirt on. It's super, super adorably cute. I fucking... Love the mermaids all over it, you know? My titties are nice and looking right. So, guys, this is the print on the shirt. It's super adorable. I, like, really, really like it. It's, like, it literally was speaking to me. It was yelling my name. It was saying, Manny, buy me. Buy me right now. Spend $45 on me. So, that's exactly what I did. It definitely doesn't look good with this choker on and stuff, but... The shirt's so really cute, though. You can't lie about that. So, yeah, guys, that's it. I think that's pretty much it. Yeah, that really is it. I also bought a water bottle, but I don't have it to show you guys. <sighs> I'm so sorry. I should have kept that water bottle. It was a regular water bottle anyway, guys. It was like $4. Whatever. Well, that's it. So, yeah, guys, that was it for today's vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I didn't really record a lot. Like I said, I'm so sorry. I, like, really wanted to enjoy myself. And plus, like, it was just so much, girl. I really, really wanted to enjoy myself and, like, meet everyone and talk to everyone. So that's kind of the main reason why, like, I didn't vlog the whole entire time. But I think I did get some good clips for you guys. Hopefully you guys enjoy the little things that I did get. And get into this makeup, girl. Get these cookies. I use a Morphe 12P palette and some J-Cat Beauty. Girl, I'm living for it. I'm wearing Baby Daddy on the lips. Actually, no, I'm wearing Diamond on the lips. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video, guys. Give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you guys like me and you guys enjoy what I do. Or enjoy me doing my makeup. I don't know. Girl, just subscribe. Why not? You're already here.